welcome aboard the SS Soggy Stakes or AKA the Miller and Carter. I can definitely feel that I'm at a strange angle. Everything's not quite straight. Wow. Look here, it's all just set out. It was hard to get any real uh, history. Oh, the Christmas tree's still up. Yeah, so this Miller and Carter actually sunk in December. So all the Christmas stuff's still up. Yeah, so this is an old, um, what they call a paddle, paddle steamer, an old type of steamboat. It was hard to get any information on it online though because it, all the articles were just about the the ship sinking um, but I think it's been here since 2007 at least from what I can tell and uh, yeah I wonder if it doesn't look like anyone was allowed to like clear anything out or wait surely someone would have had to come in to clear out any tills and safes Unless they were cashless on this one. I know some places only accept card now. Holy shit, look. Oh my god. Amazing. Look at all the beers, man. <laughs> and all the other drinks. Wines. Holy shit. Bottles and bottles of alcohol. <laughs> this is so good. Oh my god. I don't think anyone else has been in here. Good old bottle of Tabasco. Look at it. Could have a right old party on here. I mean, I don't drink anymore, so no no use to me, but I'm sure someone would enjoy having a, uh, a nice old party on here. Piping bag, trays. Just boxes of, oh wow, yeah. Christmas pack there. What we got? Oh, I love that smell. What do you get if you cross Santa with a duck? A Christmas quacker. Oh, and we've got a little puzzle. There's no hat, I wanted a hat. Oh, I'll put that back in the box. I, I could spend the day on here just chilling. Look, it's all set up because the back end of the boat did actually sink first, but it's leveled out now. So I thought this would all be over the floor, but everything stayed up pretty well. Absolutely amazing. Oh, fuck, that's taking me somewhere else. Look, <gasps> look at the painting. Why has everything got cling film on it? Don't get that. The drain's covered in cling film and the taps are covered and cling film. Not really sure what that's all about. But there's yeah, it's just around the tops. The nozzle is still exposed. Yeah, I feel like I'm pretty safe for uh, alarms. I don't think there should be any alarms because I don't think, considering this place has sunk, that there should be any power coming to this place at all. Right, it stinks out back here. Yeah, so look, you can see, I don't know if you can see that, we're at a bit of an angle now. So this ship sort of tilts towards the back and it's starting to smell really mouldy back here. So I've got a feeling. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a bit squelchy. Private. Got to go in there, haven't we? Yuck. Oh my god. That's why it's smelling mouldy. We've just got tons of fruit rotting. Wow. What is that? Oh, there's going to be all rotting flesh everywhere as well. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't think the fruit is the, the bad smell. I think it's the, uh, the rotting flesh sat around. There's just so much to look at. 
I don't think I've been to a place. Oh my god, that is that is disgusting. Yeah, something absolutely reeks. Oh, is it this? Yeah, it's whatever they are. They fucking stink. I've never. <coughs> Fuck. I need to get out of it. Oh, I just took a breath in. Oh, and my body immediately wanted that. Whatever I breathed in back out. It's just the, the smell of rotting animal flesh. Uh, I don't think I really want to go in here. It should be locked still. Yeah. Yeah, so the cash. I wonder if anyone was actually actually allowed back on the ship to retrieve any cash from in there. Because I guess that's the safe room. Um that's that's pretty interesting. So there could potentially be thousands of pounds behind that door, considering that it's still locked up. So I assume there'll be one big safe or multiple small safes in there. The way health and safety is, I don't think anyone would actually be allowed, be authorised to come inside this sinking ship to retrieve cash because it would just be covered under insurance, I guess, anyway. So yeah, got a feeling there is cash still left in there. Last orders bell. Oh shit, stop, stop, stop. Fuck, didn't think it'd be that loud. Oh, that's where I just was. I could tell because it absolutely stinks all the way out here as well. This is actually so mad. Got this whole ship to myself. I've needed this. I haven't been exploring for whew, a few weeks, good few weeks now. Been dealing with a lot of life shit and this is just, just makes you feel alive doing stuff like this. Well needed. Well needed. I came past here the other day and as soon as I saw this ship, I was like, I'm getting on that. So a few days later, that's where we are. Cheers. Yeah, I don't know, it's quite strange. As soon as I saw this place, I was just like overcome with excitement. Just like, I need to explore this. Maybe because it was uh, reminiscent of my uh, <laughs> mental state recently, a sinking ship. <laughs> wow. This is so cool. Shit. I wish I had a pair of like waders. Look here. This. <laughs> I mean, I could walk along some tables and, but I do not want to fall in this gross green water. Yeah, I wish I was able to explore that. Wow, look at it. Oh, I'm, I'm questioning if I just walk along some tables. But everything's got this weird oily coat into it. I don't know, it's strange. I suppose you know a pub table when it's got that gross, sticky feeling to the wooden tables. Everything seems to be like that. So I don't want to walk over it because um, it's quite slippery. Right, there's got to be a way up now, right? I have needed this in my life. This is so cool. Back out these doors now and up the set of stairs because there's another level above us. Obviously the bottom level we can't really explore. I might explore, I might go over a couple of the tables, but I'm gonna do upstairs first. There was a cleaner out there at one point. Oh shit, it's fenced off. Got to climb round. Right, we're up top. Holy shit, <laughs> no way. I thought there was another level to this. I didn't realize I was up, up top top. Oh, I suppose the ground level in the ship and then the one I was on are the, the two levels that you would eat at in the restaurant. For some reason I thought there was another one up top here. Oh, I really want to climb everything, but it's so obvious. Oh fuck it, let's climb it. Yeah, I don't really want to be seen because I feel like security won't do much. They'll just call police straight away. Which, ah, uh, it's a hassle. This is sketchy.
Here's the view from up top. Hell yeah. Looks like there's something else over there. So we'll try and have a look at that. Oh, there's a door. Rat traps. Oh, I'm just on the other side there. Please don't see me anybody. Just having a good old time. Right, that's not working. Can we get in here? Oh, that's just toilets. Oh, so that's blocked because when this tipped, I assume things inside have blocked against the door. Yeah, it seems like, well, seems like loads of stuff has fallen against the doors. I can't explain, this is just so much fun. Oh, and that is their, uh, oh yeah, so it was, a, it was called a paddle steamer, so that was the big paddle on the back, that's so cool. I feel like I've never seen that, even when I've been over there. All the kegs out back. Got a huge round paddle on the back. Um, not really much to see up here. It's so icy though, I'm slipping everywhere. No, there we go, just the sign. I'm being a bit risky here. Time to go back downstairs. When you're exploring something like this, just all the problems in the world just disappear. <laughs> Especially when you've got the whole place to yourself like this. Love it. I'm really debating whether I should climb along these gross tables just for the fun of it. Fuck it, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Right, the GoPro's going in my mouth, so apologies for any uh, gross mouth sounds. Just option. All right, all right. That's so. Oh my fucking god. That is not good. Oh shit, everything's starting to move because I moved the water. Stuff started making sounds over there because I made a little wave in the water. Right. That's sturdy. What is that? Is that just. Oh! That's just a cushion. Oh, it's the glasses. It sounds like I'm out at sea. <laughs> oh, the chair's filling up with water. <laughs> Right, let's try again. <coughs> yeah, my feet, look, it's so oily. <laughs> okay, okay. Aha, uh -huh, the girder. Right, we'll use this girder. We can get to the next table. Yes. Okay, okay. Oh, fuck. What was that? Holy shit. Look at these guys, they're like. Hmm. I don't sound good. Let's get out of here. So it's crunching. I really wanted to get over to the bar, but um 
I realise I'm an idiot because it is actually quite dangerous being in it because what if it can go deeper um, and I get trapped down there yeah that was probably a really stupid idea but got caught up in the fun of it right I think that is about it for this Miller and Carter then ah oh, it's been really fucking fun yeah, I've been debating whether I just give up on this channel, to be honest, recently, but uh, nah, coming here today, I definitely need to get out there and explore some more stuff. This is just, it's just too fun. I really hope you've enjoyed this one as much as I've enjoyed exploring it. I have got so many videos coming, um, bunkers, train yards, all sorts uh, so if you do enjoy this please subscribe it'd be much appreciated and um, and I've noticed a lot of people have been leaving comments recently and I love reading through the comments so you know if you spotted something I didn't or uh, you know you've got any interesting information on this place or anything at all just drop a comment I love it I love interacting with you guys watching the videos yeah, that's it for this one. I'm gonna climb back out, hopefully not fall in. I'm gonna keep the GoPro in my mouth, just in case I fall in. Nah, it's not happening, I'm not letting that happen. It's like, what, three degrees outside. Thanks again, and I'll see you next week.